assalamu alaikum guys and welcome back to my channel today we will discuss perturbation theory for differential equations consider an example we will solve here an example about the um, examples like the examples of differential equation on perturbation theory so here uh, we have an example consider d square y by d theta square equals minus epsilon dy by d theta minus 1 so here are the boundary uh, boundary and the boundary condition for this uh, equation is y of 0 equals 0 dy by d theta of 0 equals 1 so now let us assume the expansion as we can uh, as I explained in the in the previous lectures perturbation theory singular perturbation theory that uh, first we will um, take an expansion form for the equation like this uh, so it, it is the this is the uh, expansion form for the differential equation now you can see here the expansion form like this y of tau equals y uh, equals y naught of tau plus epsilon y1 of tau plus epsilon square y2 of tau plus big O uh, epsilon cube and this is the equation too. Now we will um, sub substitute equation 2 in equation 1 and we get the following um, equation like this. So after simplification we get a d square ta square into uh, of y naught plus 1 and this is the plus uh, epsilon term and this is the plus epsilon square term uh, and this is the big O of e uh, epsilon cube equals 0. Now uh, equation, uh, equating the coefficient of epsilon it becomes it becomes the uh, d square y naught by d ta square plus 1 equals 0 and the boundary condition for this uh, uh, is y naught of 0 equals 0 d y naught by d tau of 0 equals 1 and also similarly for the this is the epsilon uh, term this is the epsilon square term so and these are the boundary condition for these equations now solving the both equations we get uh, uh, d square y naught of by d tau square plus 1 equals 0 and after uh, integrating both sides um, the, we will we get uh, the following equation uh, dy naught by d tau equals minus tau plus some constant and uh, again we take integrate both we take in integrating uh, integrate integrating both sides so after integrating uh, these terms we get y naught of tau equals minus tau square by 2 plus tau and after simplifying after arrange um, after arranging it we get an equation 4 so now the second equation was d square y1 by d tau square plus d y naught by d tau equals 0 and now take um, an integral sign on both sides and after integration after integrating it we get the following equation dy1 by d tau square plus t minus t uh, tau square divided by 2 equals 0 and again taken uh, integral uh, integral both sides and after integrating it we get in the following equation now you can see here the equation 5 uh, now uh, the second uh, the third equation was d square y2 by d tau square plus dy1 by d tau equals 0 and uh, integrating both sides here you can see the following equations plus tau square by 2 minus tau cube by 6 and again take int uh, and int again uh, take integral both sides so after integrating we get the following equation 6 here you can see y2 of tau equals tau cube by 6 minus tau 4 by 24 uh, the equation 6 putting these values in equation 2 we we have the following solution like this so um, this is the last equation of the differential equation by the perturbation theory so we can we solved it thank you and Allah Hafiz